Yeah, I think my brain wanted to go there, but I was kind of like, what? And it was over here, but I was reaching for it over here. This is one of those things like chicken soup. Hear me out. Maybe same? Yes, maybe same. Here's how. My grandmother loved chicken soup to have chicken parts in it. I like the chicken broth. I like the noodles. I like the rice. I, of course, anything with rice I love. Chicken rice soup, yum. <sighs> sighing once, sighing twice, sighing chicken soup with rice. My grandmother wanted pieces. It's like, well, I don't, even if it weren't neck pieces and little leftover bits, I don't want chunks in my chicken soup. I just like the broth. I like matzo ball soup. Broth, matzo ball, like, how can you go wrong? This is how I feel about anchovies. I love, love, love the taste of a Caesar salad, but I don't generally like dealing with the anchovies. I don't like dealing with the crouton. <laughs> so I like the flavor profile, but basically if you could make me a Caesar salad smoothie, I'd be, nah, that's not true. Let's not get carried away. But I will say this, I didn't realize that anchovies were amazing until just a few years ago, I tried white anchovies. They are so delicious, it makes my stomach growl. They're more tender, somehow more fishy, which makes them better because they're like, yes, you know, they're like the drag queens of anchovies. They're like the Carmen Miranda fruit on the head of movie stars. They're like, yes, I'm an anchovy. So I've come to love anchovies, not just anchovy paste, not just essence of anchovy, essence of gelfling, essence of chicken. I love these little white anchovies. If you haven't tried them, I would recommend it if you're if you're strong enough to try it. Mm -hmm.